Here at home, we're taking a closer look at the next steps to revamp one of Buffalo's main small business hubs. Now, the city's Allentown neighborhood has been the center of a major revitalization project for the last few years now. The Allentown Streetscape project is about to enter its final phase next week. But as our Johnson person found out tonight, new concerns from neighbors about public safety along Allen Street are now turning into a call for action. Well, Febin, several of business owners from Allentown took part in a special meeting tonight to make their voices heard on how to make the future of Allentown better, not only for them, but for neighbors and visitors in the area. I was at that meeting tonight as part of our follow up series, looking into the stories that matter to your community. A call for change from more than a dozen business owners to help the future of Allentown. I think we need to hold council members, uh, the police force, uh, we need to hold them all accountable uh, for making it a safe place. The call coming after a survey put out by the University at Buffalo brought in more than 400 responses from local business owners voicing concerns over crime and parking and hope something will be done. The crime's not going anywhere. Uh, let's be realistic about this. It is the third poorest city in the, in the nation regardless of how many condos you build. So, um, Some of the concerns, definitely the new parking situation. A lot of people don't know, understand it. It's too high. Um, they're crashing into poles, um, that sort of thing. And there was incidents of crime back in the holiday season, but things have gotten better. So it's all come back to normal again. Professor Conrad Kicker of the University at Buffalo tells me the whole point of getting together is to create a vision for Allentown's future. The city really needs to pick up this district and and uh, make sure that the investment that has been done in the street, the streetscape, comes to fruition. You know, this is really the first step in the future of Allentown. But do these stakeholders feel they're being heard by the city? In my experience, no. <laughs> Uh, we pretty much take care of each other, our block, so if something's going on, we just handle it on our own. Now, Professor Kicker tells me he's hopeful the city will take neighbors' concerns into consideration as they move forward with the streetscape project. And Buffalo Common Council member Mitch Nowakowski, who represents the neighborhood, has yet to respond to my request for comment. In studio, Jocelyn Person, 7 News.